guys, what's going on? How's everyone doing today? I'm doing well, thank you for asking. Well, here we are, October the 7th, Thursday, feeling good. I got one more day left to work tomorrow, and then we're off for fall break uh, the following week. So I'm feeling pretty good, feeling pumped. All right, let's get to it, guys. Now, if you've been following my workout this week, uh, you know that I'm using uh, only an easy bar for my workouts, okay? That goes for all my workouts. Let me turn this this way just a hair. There we go. <clears throat> I know I've got the light behind me, so it's kind of not perfect, but eh, we're dealing with it. So we are just using the easy bar for this workout as well. What am I going to do today? <clears throat> today, I believe I'm going to do back. And... Uh, that's going to consist mostly of, since we're only using an easy bar, uh, it's going to consist mostly of just bent rows. Um, not a whole lot more you can do for back, but I am going to even try one more movement. It's going to be real awkward, I'm sure. I'm going to try one movement with it. And uh, this is really just to try and show you what you can do with uh, bare minimal equipment. Now, I don't have a whole lot of equipment in here. I have dumbbells, and then I have my easy bar, and then I have my lamp machine, uh, FID bench, and my heck press. That's what I have. Um, so when it comes to doing other types of things outside of dumbbell, it's a little you know tricky if I wanna use barbells or anything like that. I don't really have the setup. So we're going to get started on this back routine and uh, I'm not going to do a whole lot of video as far as like bent rows because, well, we all know you can use a barbell for bent rows, so you can probably use an easy bar for bent rows. I do it every week, but uh, we will get a, a couple of shots in there just to give you an idea of what it is and how you do it. And uh, sometimes the easy bar can be a little... Uh, um, better in some aspects because it's shorter and in my opinion this is where shorter is uh, better guys this shorter bar kind of allows the weight to stay more centered in your body uh, I really feel I don't know if it's scientific or anything like that but it's a feeling I have that uh, normally you have your big seven foot long bars that you're using and uh, the weights are out here, way out here. And uh, with the shorter, I'm gonna say it's probably four foot long, I'm not sure, uh, easy bar. And uh, you can also get small, uh, shorter uh, standard type bars, you know, Olympic, uh, for Olympic weights, but you can get them in uh, shorter sizes. And you can also use standard bars, you know, the one inch type bars. But uh, I think it uh, keeps the weight uh, more centered into your body. And uh, I think it could even be safer. I think it could work your muscles a little differently. So you might want to look into something like that if all you're used to using is your standard longer, you know, seven foot bars or so. So uh, anyway, let's get started on this uh, bent row and uh, we'll go from there. And we are going to try one exercise. Never tried it before in my life with an easy bar. It's going to be a tricky one. Let's get started, guys. All right, today we're gonna to start out with 90 pounds. Uh, nothing too light, nothing too heavy. We're just gonna start out with that. Got myself all nice and wrapped up and ready to go. set of these with this weight and then we'll check back okay and stick around for that new movement that we're all going to try together all right guys i got 140 on the bar now 
And we're just going to do a quick clip of this one and then I'll move on to uh, another set. All right. So pay attention, watch your form, and do this with safety in your mind, okay? Let's do this. All right, guys, we got 160. guys now we're getting up into the little heavier weights I got 180 pounds and then plus the bar whatever that is so we got to still remember to keep our bodies nice and tight our core is nice and tight keep everything in control especially when you start getting up into the little heavier weights now I'm not going to use my straps right now but when I go up a little heavier I will be so let's get this done and uh, move on to the next episode. Alright guys, we have 230 pounds on the bar now, not including the bar. I do have my straps. I am going to use those. Straps allow you to move more weight and to actually feel the weight and get the benefits from the weight rather than having to worry about your grip strength. Uh, failing so although I could probably do this for a few reps without them I'm gonna go ahead and strap it on on baby strap it on and be safe you're getting up into the heavier weights now be safe guys keep everything in control don't go above what you feel comfortable with until you're ready okay so let's get this uh, set right here done and we'll keep going all right now i know in a lot of these videos i say i'm not going to keep filming because you already know what it looks like, or I don't want to bore you with too many sets and reps. Well, I lie. I always end up filming, guys. I can't help it. I think it benefits me, and I think it benefits you in some way, so I usually end up filming a lot more than I planned on. So, this set right here was 230 pounds, and uh, I'm going to top out at 300 pounds. So, we're going to throw on some uh, 35s and we're gonna stop at uh, 300 pounds now I might do one set of say four or I might do two sets of two something like that it just depends on how I feel now this is gonna be heavy my form's not gonna be spot-on and even with the 230 it was uh, you know it wasn't as uh, perfect form as you might hope to maybe have but Again, you have to kind of get outside your comfort zone sometimes to progress. So let's uh, get these weights on here and uh, go up a little bit more. All right, guys, last set of rows, most likely. We're up at 300 pounds. It ain't gonna be pretty, but you need to know your limits, guys. And I know my limits. I know I'm gonna be able to do this okay and not get hurt. I know what to expect. So, and it's just to move the weight, okay? You gotta build up the confidence and you gotta build up your strength one way or another. And sometimes that means doing something that ain't pretty. Like I said, it ain't pretty. All right, now like I said, 
Sometimes it's not pretty guys. That wasn't pretty, but I moved some weight and I made sure that I kept everything close to my body. I kept everything nice and tight and I did the movement as best I could uh, to make sure that I at least got the weight up. I moved it a little bit and it, it, it was safe enough for me to do, so I did it. Now, I count that as two reps. They were ugly reps, but I'm gonna do one more set of two more ugly reps. And uh, that's just the way that I do it. This is really uh, not necessarily a, a perfect form how-to video. This is more of a look what you can do with your easy bar video. And uh, just be careful with these types of movements no matter what weight you're using because you can literally just bend over and grab the, an empty bar and throw your back out. I've done it. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this last set done. I'm not gonna record it. You've seen what that looked like. It's gonna look about the same. Then we're gonna get on to one exercise with the easy bar that I know you've probably never done and I know I've never done, but it just kind of hit me today and I'm kind of excited to see if it's even gonna work. All right, so let me get this done. So what I'm gonna do with this easy bar is I'm gonna try and mimic a one arm dumbbell rows. It's gonna be weird, but I'm gonna try it. And if it succeeds, then that's one more thing you can do with your easy bar. So let's try it guys, first time. What do you know guys, I think that was a success. Now that was my first time ever doing that. That was my first set. I still got three more to go. Uh, what I can say is it felt decent, but I also felt like maybe I was, uh, maybe tweaked, tweaked a little bit or something. And I don't know if it's because I was nervous of how I was holding the bar or what have you, but I am gonna, I'll do one more shot of uh, another set and uh, kind of see what I think and uh, go from there. But it, overall, it felt decent. Now, I wouldn't say you'd want to go up super heavy. I don't know. It felt fairly uh, balanced. So I think it's a success personally, but uh, let's get another set done. And uh, I will video this next set, but the last two sets I won't video because why? All right, so let's get on this next set. And I'm going to start with my left arm this time because the weight's already over here. So I might as well go ahead and start over here. So just remember to get yourself nice and set on the bench here. Try and keep your back as uh, nice and tight and flat as you can. And uh, just be careful with what you're doing. guys there's two sets and uh, I think that they worked out really well the second set felt a whole lot better uh, I kind of was uh, just kind of had to 
torqued my body a little bit to where it felt more natural. And I think I was just a little odd and uh, unsure of the first set uh, that I did. So second set felt a whole lot better. I say it's a success. I say that you could totally use an easy bar for doing one arm rows, no problem. So I hope you learned something today. I know I did. I still got two sets to do. I'm gonna get those done and out the way in a minute after we uh, sign off here. So anyways, guys, uh, like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. Let me know if you've tried these down in the comments. Let me know your experience if you have, or let me know if maybe I uh, enlightened your day by showing you something new. I think I enlightened my own day. Check out the playlist, guys. Mikey Sun TV has everything you're gonna want from exercising, uh, cycling, walking, daily vlogs, some video game stuff off in there, movie TV discussions, some children's book readings, some cooking. I've done some really hot stuff, uh, hot taste tests. Um, I, I, I've done all kinds of stuff, just you know, like man cave stuff. You can see me construct my entire man cave from beginning to end. Uh, you can see me uh, put my gym together, uh, every piece that I've gotten so far. And uh, you can go through my life and my journey with me. And uh, yeah, hopefully I'm going to inspire you. And I hope you inspire someone throughout your day, your week, your month, your year, or just this minute, okay? Don't forget, guys. Get up, get out, get red, do it to it. And we'll see you next time on Mikey Sun TV. And the next video is going to be about what can we do with the easy bar for shoulders. All right, we'll see you. Get up, get out, get ready, do it, do it.